We are gonna be getting into this in just a second. All right, let's go. This is actually winner's quarterfinals. Here we go. Solomar, Solomar and Legit versus Luis, Luis and Smurf. Yep. We got the Smurfs here. Let's see. Blue team, Smurf colors versus red team. Right now, we got Olimar, Diddy Kong. Uh, what do you think of, uh, what do you actually think about this? I feel like Solomar is going to try, mostly try to use the Pikmin to rat, uh, latch on percent, which uh, Olimar mostly is strong at. And also try and maybe throw him into some Diddy follow-ups or even get Diddy throws into like purple. Honestly, so Solomar just in doubles is actually a god and I don't, He's one of the people that's like, I can't imagine what he's thinking because he's doing so much at once and just yeah. being uh, so, aware of his pick, so aware of his Pikmin where everyone is at a, t at a time. Even if he has two Pikmin latched on and he has a purple behind him, he knows exactly what he wants to do at yeah, every the, moment. Yeah, the attention to detail is so precise. I mean, we'll Oh, think nice forward smash charge, but, he's got, but his partner is going to get punished too. Losing stocks pretty equally. Yeah, I feel like the main concern is definitely, uh, at least for Solomar at high percents, they're going to have to look out for the Mega Man Up Air Tornado, because that can definitely kill Solomar, even Diddy Kong at pretty, or Olimar and Diddy Kong at pretty low percents. Yeah. It, it, and one thing that Solomar's always been really good at is rotating his Pikmin. Yeah, Super you good at rotating his Pikmin and knowing when to throw out the purple and when to throw out all his other Pikmin. That Pikmin... I just saw Luis's down air went straight through Solomar's up air. I don't know what Pikmin that was. That didn't look like a white. It was... I'm pretty sure that was either a red or a yellow, and it just went straight through? I guess it was okay. really high priority. But anyways, uh, we are dead even right now in stocks. Uh, slight lead for blue team, in terms of percent. All right, nice grab Great. to up tilt combo. Yeah, grab Shoryuken. Very good bread and butter. Ooh, Luis, yeah. It's very to go good for, for, for any Mega Man team. Mm -hmm. You got to have a partner that's that knows how to hold a grab. Yeah, I like how, I mean, uh, Luis has been getting lots of grabs, too. He's getting lots of grabs, and it's giving uh, Smurf a really easy chance just to get up tilt. That's a setups. forward smash on Solomar. Red team down to both their last stocks. Yeah, I've played doubles a little bit with Fremont's Finest, and they are definitely really strong with Synergy. Uh, yeah, that was actually a really good save. He's going to use the Leaf Shield. He's going to get back to center stage. Yeah, and he, he's, using, he's using an up air, so he sends him straight up. He didn't have a jump left, but the, he had plenty of heights with the up beat. I'm impressed of um, with the... With the grab setups that Luis is able to give for Smurf, he's able to get pellets into them. He's able to get up tilts into them. You're able to get lots of potential out of that whole entire setup. Four Smash finally does it though, and Smurf is on his last stock. I'll be completely honest. I'm not even impressed. I, this is just usual. This is what they usually do. <laughs> it's, this just, is, it's just it's just Fremont. This is being average for them. This is just Fremont being Fremont. <laughs> yeah. But we will see. We will see what goes on right now. Actually, three socks to three socks too. Uh, legit a high percent. So it looks like. He's going to either have to play really conservative, or he's going to have to take Solomar stock soon if he does die. Uh, no, Solmar doesn't have a second stock. Oh, he doesn't? Oh, no. wow, so it's three stocks to two. Yeah. That's big, too, and Solmar relatively getting into kill percent right now. Tight situation there, Luis. Nice. Yeah, up down throw going to kill it. Or up throw or down throw is going to kill it. Yeah, that was up an up smash. Throw. Not enough. Yeah. Purple up smash not quite gonna do it. Yeah, was that a Mario back air that killed um, legit? I'm not surprised if it is. It was a it was a move. Uh, Let's see what's what's Solomar's Pikmin lineup right now. It is just a, it's white purple. Oh, double purple. purple right now. Two purple is actually very strong. The up smash not gonna kill, but the next one is definitely gonna do it. Uh, one good purple probably will kill Smurf. One good purple is definitely gonna kill Smurf. But it's gonna be how are they gonna get? How is he gonna get rid of Luis? That's gonna be the main question at this point. Um, he's gonna do what he's doing now. He's gonna oh get around. They're, he's got, they're gonna try to sandwich him, and Solomar is gonna get around it because he's a god. Uh, this is really smart. On uh, I like how Smurf. He's just using pallets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. free grab. Sure, you can. I like you how he just stood there for a sec though. <laughs> just like, and then, and then, and then just yeah, he's like, he's like, here yeah. you go, boom. But um. You see how the uh, I liked how um, Smurf. He was, you saw he was just kind of shooting the pallets, kind of walling out and stuffing all the Pikmin that Solomar had, and he was, it kind of took Pikmin off the table too. And Solomar was kind of forced to go after Luis at that point. Yeah, it can be very difficult for all for Olimar in certain matchups, uh, just because the some characters have really good tools to negate Pikmin's so Pikmin use at all, and some some don't. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna ask, is this a best of three or best of five? Uh, probably gonna be best of three. I'd th say that like top three is gonna be best yeah. of five. Flo just gave me the three, uh, the three fingers, so okay. that's mean best of three. 
All right, and Lilac, game two. What do you think of Lilac on this pick? I think Lilac's a terrible pick almost always. <laughs> <laughs> but I no, I can definitely see it. Diddy can be fairly good on Lilac. Uh, Sol Solomar as well. I know him to go to Lilac for certain uh, for certain picks in singles. And Olimar doesn't su suffer too much. I uh, I, I feel like Yuppie definitely does benefit a little bit. Yeah. But it can be. Oh my, legit almost broke a shield in that situation. I don't think any any of these characters re can really suffer too much from the Lilat til Lilat tilting. Uh, it's a really it's a really fun gameplay mechanic. Sometimes. Yeah, it really is. It can sometimes it's like a it's like Randall and Melee. You just don't know. It's like is he yeah. except wh wh what times the four coming out? What time that's like that? The only difference with Randall is you don't accidentally go through Randall sometimes. <laughs> Randall doesn't carry you through the middle of the you stage. You can edge cancel and shield drop off of him though. So, but anyways, back to the match. Uh, actually, two stock lead for uh, for blue team right now. Uh, but red uh, red team still at low percent, and blue team is relatively near kill percent. Gra uh, banana forward smash, not enough to kill Smurf. Yeah, I think no one rage. more will probably kill Smurf. That was a purple Pikmin up here. Yeah, yeah, Luis is gone. And, I mean, they're still slowly bringing it back. It's going to really come down to it, how much is Smurf going to stock tank. Because it looks like Smurf is going to kind of play the role of the stock tank. Usually Smurf, uh, stock, Smurf stock tanking is one of the best. He, he knows exactly how to do, do well, it, how Mega, to stay safe. And Mega Man in general He's, he's a semi-heavy so character, too. So that definitely goes to his He's favorite. a robot. He's made of metal. Yep, I mean, super fighting robot showing his super fighting strength right now. But... Up throw finally takes a stock, and we're at even stocks right now. But both, uh, but both Olimar and Diddy Kong got high percents. Yeah, this is gonna be very. I think this is really the whole time just an uphill battle for Red Team. Because uh, it. Oh my gosh! What a great set to just grab up till. Those gets the shore you can. Yeah, those quick kind of go for it again, but does not get it. Yeah, those quick kind of kill confirms are one of the reasons that it can be so intimidating to be down or even even uh, against this team. Yeah, and just like that, both Solomar and Legit down to their last stocks. Pretty much finest, showing why they are the finest right now. Yeah, there's the the one thing. Solomar and Legit as a as a team, they they don't have. I don't want to say they don't have anything special because that's not right. But it's like they. What they do isn't any. It's not anything completely unique. They just yeah. dominate. And if they can't dominate, if they good, can't dominate, they it's don't. It's like good player on good player yeah. sort of thing. Oh, I think he, yeah. Wow, he got Lilac right there. And that's a that's actually a favorable tree for Fremont's finest right now. Trying to take him off the top with a tornado or a Mario FB. Trying to steal his money there. Oh, right now, oh my gosh! It's a down air. That's it. Jin Solomar are no more in the winner's bracket. Yeah, but it looks like they're smiling. It looks like they had a good time either way. I think they'll definitely be rebounding in losers, but Fremont's Finest, great, great play by Fremont's Finest right there. Yeah,